we, we actually talked to four different groups and it had uh, varied ranks, varied ages, and we asked them questions about uh, what, what they thought about alcohol-related misconduct and trying to get their ideas. And the one message that came consistently forward to us is that they wanted more information. They wanted to know exactly what was happening in the area of alcohol-related misconduct. I'd say that what we're what we're looking to do is, you know, it's to educate people on alcohol use overall, and it's to educate people on the negative consequences of, of alcohol use. And uh, the message we're trying to give out is, if you're of age, then uh, it's your choice, but it's also your responsibility. So for me, looking at me personally, it would, it would be my choice, it's my choice, but it's my responsibility also. What I hope happens with this, with this board is that we we continue to talk about DUIs, yes, but we want to expand that to continue to talk about all alcohol-related misconduct and educate everyone that there's, there's a, a lot of misconduct that goes on beyond just the DUIs. And unfortunately, that's what ends up getting people, it ends up ruining careers. It ends up ruining people's lives in certain cases. We, we don't want that to happen. We, don't want, we do not want one more person to receive an LOR, an Article 15, or to be discharged from the Air Force for alcohol-related misconduct.